Firefighter paramedic Nick Sabayan's life-saving instincts prevented a tragedy at a local hospital. We were waiting for a bed at the hospital uh, when I witnessed a patient that was already at the hospital attack a nurse. What I saw was a nurse get shoved out of the room she was helping the patient with, threw her across the hall, she hit the wall, and then uh, that's when we went over there to make sure everything was okay. The patient retreated back to his room until he saw a Fountain Valley police officer arrive. After the patient had shoved the nurse, he went back into his room. Right when the Fountain Valley police officer showed up, without seeing the patient, the police officer walked by, the patient came out of the room and physically attacked the officer, throwing him against the wall. During the whole commotion, I was able to help take the patient down to the ground until the police officer can regain control of the situation. He was able to use a less lethal force, and then he was able to put the patient in handcuffs. Nick's quick and heroic actions potentially saved countless lives. I just knew I needed to help. I saw a female nurse uh, being attacked by a patient. I felt like I can uh, give out a lending hand. And not only just for the ER nurse that was there, the ER was crowded with multiple patients, uh, other fire companies, uh, and multiple nurses as well who could have been endangered. I think that the moral compass of every firefighter is to just do the right thing and treat every person like they're your family. I would be confident that anyone else in the fire service would do something similar to Nick, but I'm just glad he was here that day. Nick is a real hero because he acted without thinking of his own personal safety. As a firefighter, knowing firefighters, we don't get into this job to be a hero. We don't think of ourselves as heroes truly. That's just, that's not what we're thinking about every day. Nonetheless, heroes emerge when they're put into a situation such as Nick, when he reacted with no training, with no prompting, just to dive in on a much, much larger person with himself being at risk to save others. Especially the way I was brought up, both my parents raised me to help someone whenever they're in need. I don't believe I'm a hero. Um, I believe I was in the right place at the right time. and. Uh, anytime someone's in need of help, I'm there to help.